this is what snake hex looks like you can see how beautiful looking it is when the snake lay and from here we do the incubation of the hex this is the process how the snake hex is being incubated for about 21 days then here is the ashlings young baby snail newly hatched snake from here this is the first stage you can see the snail ash from the egg you can see how tender it is young baby snail see how beautiful looking it is you can see it it takes 21 days to get these ashlings this is how we feed them with succulent fruit so as you see how they are green they are really green snake farming is really amazing something you need to try if you haven't tried snake farming you really need to try to see how beautiful it is you really need to see the process you see it is really amazing you can see you see how grow and uh, they are green you see how beautiful looking it's an amazing farming it is less capital intensive Somebody, some persons have been thinking, how do we go about snake farming? It's a very easy farming. It doesn't take much of your time. Less capital intensive. Easy to start. You can do it at the comfort of your home. Snake farming is less time consuming. Snake feed is within most time around the environment. Most of times what we see as refuse can be used to feed our snails like the left over papa some parts of garbage left use watermelon those are things we can feed our snail and they will be growing every day why don't you try to see the amazing part of snail farming why don't you try to see the good part of it the green of the snails